get to the story of the day, and guess what? It's talking about a little bit of snow. Not to panic. Don't push the panic button yet. It isn't going to be a big storm, but nevertheless, there's still going to be some more snow in the air tomorrow for some places. Now, in Worcester, it has snowed 23 of the last 47 days in Worcester. It's been a snowy March. 16 days in March, it snowed, and even in April, seven days, snow has fallen in Worcester. So how about that? We got 30s right now, mid to upper 30s for the most part. Across the North American continent, I do have some good news for you in that there are no more sub-zero readings on the map this morning. I think this is the first time I've shown this map for months and months that we haven't had some readings at least way up in Canada that's below zero. Even our friends at Baker Lake are having a heat wave. It's 12 above zero there this morning. So anyway, this is what we're looking at for highs today, about 53 to 55 degrees. So it'll be a little bit warmer than yesterday was by about mm, up to five degrees higher than yesterday. The real warmth is off to the southwest and eventually and gradually this milder air is coming our way. So got to be a little bit more patient, but we got to watch this storm right here it's going to be moving very fast. It's way out here in the plain states, but at this time tomorrow morning, the precipitation from that will just about be, be starting here, so it's really going to be zipping along. So it's moving so fast, it isn't going to give us much of a storm at all. That's the one that gave us all the problems here for Marathon Monday. So we're looking at a mainly sunny start to this day. There are some patches of clouds around, but it looks like for the most part, many of us will see more sunshine at least to start the day than we did yesterday. But it'll turn partly cloudy from time to time. I think overall, there'll be fewer clouds around today than we had yesterday, and we're going up to the middle 50s. Tonight we start dropping off and drop down in the 30s and here we are tomorrow morning at 6:30, and it's raining in Boston. Light to moderate rain here but here's this blue shading indicative of some wet snow which is going to be moving across northern Massachusetts primarily from northern Worcester County westward. Now there may be occasionally some wet snowflakes mixed in there from place to place and this is going to be moving along and then it's going to be winding down as a little bit of snow or flakes in Boston. So there's the system right there. It's moving along. It's not going to be a big system but how much could we get out of this? Not much of anything. It may end up as a few snowflakes in Boston tomorrow night, but right along this area here, a coating up to two inches primarily in higher terrain places, primarily on non-paved surfaces, and that's even going to start tomorrow morning. So this is the area out here, northwestern Massachusetts and southwestern New Hampshire, which may have most of the snow. Here's your forecast for the next seven days. Looks like this. It's a cold day tomorrow with that rain and wet snow mixed, and then back to some sunshine. Breaks of sun on Friday with a gusty wind. It gets better and better as we go through the weekend, getting in the 50s, and next week, I think we got some 60s starting on Monday.